Spirit houses can be found throughout the Seminole and Muscogee Creek country in Oklahoma. It's a long tradition that was started in the southeast before the tribes were removed to Indian Territory. Most tribes in North America have unique burial practices. It is said the Muscogee people may have buried their dead inside the homes or under arbors near their home. This evolved into building log grave house coverings. Some say the body was put inside of the log home and then it was burned. Others say the body was put underground in a fetal position and the log houses were on top. The log house coverings were left until they fell back into the earth. This practice still holds true today. Times of growing up, when would leave the house up there, headed for the creek over there. I'd come through here, we'd come through here, and there were some old spirit houses. And when they built them, they, um, they never came back and repaired them. They would always be allowed to deteriorate uh, back to a natural state. And uh, I often wondered about that. I worked with historic preservation and, and, and had uh, a lot of occasion to travel back to the southeast. And, and one of the things that I looked for uh, was evidence of these uh, spiritual houses that were built back in the southeast. Uh, what, I was, what I found was uh, I was able to trace back as far as to about 1820, whenever they built a one of these houses we call them, uh, they use natural elements to only leave their footprint on the land and so that eventually even that um, would no longer exist at some point. With new technology and supplies, the spirit houses today look very modern but they still hold true to their original meaning. The spirit houses are built on the fourth day after the burial, starting early in the morning and ending by nightfall. A diamond shape is sometimes cut out of the wood in the front of the house, giving a place for the spirit to exit. Belongings of the departed are placed inside the house. These items of comfort help provide an easy transition for the spirit. Today, only a few people still make these houses. Fewer and fewer families keep this tradition alive. Spirit houses are one of the many things that make Seminole and Muscogee Creek people unique in Oklahoma today.